Big City goalkeeper Carl Rush with us, with us. Carl, a hard point? Yeah, it was a tough point away from home. I thought that it was a good result, really. Um, especially when we come to a place like this, um, I thought that we did well to keep the clean sheet. And as a defence and with me as well, we can't really ask for much more. Um, obviously, we had our chances and I think that it's disappointing that we couldn't convert them into goals. But it would be more disappointing if we didn't have any chances at all. I know that our keeper made a couple of good saves, especially in the second half, uh, that kept it in us. And then towards the end, we had a good few blocks on the line. It just shows that... You know the defence and everybody's putting the body on the line to secure the clean sheet. And how long have you been sort of working on that back four? Because obviously you've been playing a three for a while. Yeah, yeah. So it's something that you know we're going to try. We are, we already know what it's like to be a part four, but and then we try and stuff out. Um, I think that we want to be more aggressive going forward and more offensive. I think that cause we know that we're really good and strong defensively, and that's an area that we can work on is offensively. So, um, but yeah, as I said, we got we're getting our chances, and it's just about converting them now. It might seem an odd thing to say, but you didn't have a lot to do, did you, in terms of saves? I can't remember you making, like, I'm uh, probably going to be correct me, and there was one, right? I can't think, like, oh, stunning save from Carlos or something like that. No, nothing. I think my kit's still clean, so I might wear it <laughs> next week. Um, but no, yeah, that, that just, you know, we credit that to um, the defence, and, you know, they're putting their body on the line and doing their jobs, and then I don't have to do anything. It's just about me just keeping on top of them, and, you know, I think all I had to do was the goal kicks, and, and that's, a, that's about it, really. Um, so I was a bit surprised when you wanted me for media. But, um, but yeah, it's just credit to the defence for doing my job for me, pretty much. And I guess the challenge for the team as a whole is just to try and create a bit more. There was a bit more attacking attempt with the, the sort of the um, selection at the start with effectively four up. Yeah, yeah, it was. I think that obviously that's what the gaffer said. He said that we, we're really good defensively. We've got a good record, especially at home, like unbeaten. Um, so it just shows how good we are defensively. It's just about trying to convert chances that we're creating. And how do you feel about your own form? Are you happy with it? I mean, it looks like you're going to have, uh, sort of, I think a little few days to go, but it looks like you're going to be with us for the season. Are you happy with your form? Yeah, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. Uh, obviously, I'm just going to get more confident um, as the, the weeks go by when, when I get more games under my, under my belt. But um, yeah, I'm enjoying it. Really good group of lads. And I feel as though that, yeah, we're, we're building up a form now, obviously, now that thankfully we've ended our streak of away defeats. Um, now that we've got the clean sheet, it's something big for us to build on. And, you know, with the next two home games, we're, in, we're really good. Uh, and is League One a step up for you? Can you feel the, the difference? Yeah, yeah, I think it's a step up. I think that obviously the quality is better, um, but there's still areas that are similar. Um, so and then it was just about adapting and trying to, you know, work on my weaknesses as much as I can. And I think that that's, that's been happening this season. And you, your parent club obviously keeping an eye, they'll be very happy tonight with a big win for them, but uh, your parent club keeping in contact? Yeah, yeah, we always speak after every game, you know, he, uh, with Jack Stern, the goalkeeper coach, he'll, um, he'll get my opinion on uh, what I thought, how I thought the game went before he watched it back and then he'll watch it back and then give his opinion as well, so that's good. And then along with Scott, Scott keeps contact with, um, with Brighton as well. So it's a good little um, circle pretty much between me, Scott and, uh, Scott and Lincoln and, and Brighton.